Hey friends, today I'm gonna to be sharing my March favorites. It's gonna be beauty as well as some random favorites. But before I begin, I wanted to share some fun news. I teamed up with audible.com and they're offering you friends a free credit to one book to download and listen to. It's pretty much an audiobook that you can download or an ebook and you get a free credit and a 30 day free trial with my code or my link www.audible.com slash aprilathena7 and I think it's such a smart idea they have over 150,000 selections that you can pick so that's a lot of different audiobooks that you can download and listen to and I think it's so smart because I usually read like you know paperback books but it's so smart to be listening to books because you can be cleaning doing errands you can be driving and listening to the audio Book, so that's really awesome. So definitely check it out and I'll link it below. As far as book recommendations that I found on the audible.com site, I definitely want to download the Shantaram book because I have the paperback book and it's like 900 pages and sometimes I can't just sit and like read the book. I have to like do stuff. I have to do laundry. I have to cook and I could be listening to the book while I'm doing all of that. And Chantaram is about this man. It's like a real life story about a man who was a felon and he escapes and he goes to Mumbai, India and he depicts his whole life story like just experiencing life in India and I just think it's fascinating because I'm so interested and just fascinated by the Indian culture. And then another book that I would probably download and read or listen to is this book called um, Baby Whisperer because I've been reading a lot of books because I'm gonna be a mommy soon. I'm th almost 37 weeks pregnant, so I wanna get the Baby Whisperer. I read the Happiest Baby on the Block book already, so if you guys wanna download that, I recommend it. It teaches you how to calm your baby from crying and all these techniques. The last book I would recommend is Fault in Our Stars. I read that book. It's by John Green and it's really sad if you guys like a sad book. And so those are some of my recommendations if you guys need any. If you guys have any book recommendations for me to download and listen to, I would love your feedback. Just leave it in the comments section. So let's go ahead and get started with my beauty favorite. I probably talked you guys' ear off because I talk about this all the time. But you guys, I'm talking about it again because I truly believe in it. I love it. It's inexpensive. It's drugstore. It's the Revlon Color Stay Powder. I get mine in light medium and if you have oily skin, if you want, you know, a matte finish, oh, this is the best. I have it on my face right now and I use it um, or I use a brush instead of like the puff that comes in it. And the brush that I like to use is a flat top fluffy brush or a flat top kabuki type of brush. And this is my Bubby brush and Bubs Beauty, she has really good brushes. So I definitely recommend her brushes as well. Um, so both of these together is heavenly. Another favorite of mine that I'm actually wearing is the Revlon Just Bitten Kissable Lip Stain. And I like the color Smitten. It's so pretty. It's the red that I'm wearing right now. It's so wearable and easy to apply. It's moisturizing. And also when you wipe your lips, the stain still stays on. So it's very long lasting and oh, I just love it. And it has a slight peppermint scent which is really nice as well so I definitely recommend it and again it's drugstore so you can't really go wrong because drugstore isn't so bad of a price. I shared this on my Instagram account as well as my daily vlog April Justin TV. I am like going bananas over it. It is my favorite favorite facial exfoliant. It's about 30 bucks, so it's not the cheapest, but it works so beautifully. It's by The Balm. It's called Time Bomb Skincare White T micro exfoliation or microdermabrasion. It's a face exfoliating scrub. It's free of parabens, free of dyes and all that jazz. It smells really good. What I like most about it is it really exfoliates my skin. It kind of feels like the Kate Somerville Exfolicate. I've tried that one. I like it, but it's like 80 bucks. Ain't nobody got money for that. I mean, well, some people do and some people will spend that money, but $80 for a facial scrub, that is crazy. This is a once a week treatment. You just pretty much exfoliate your face. I like to do it in the shower and it's so fine and thin that like after I use it and after I exfoliate, my skin feels so soft. This is not a daily exfoliant, just something that you do once a week. My daily exfoliant is the Michael Todd Jojoba scrub that I always talk about. It's like that black charcoal scrub, but this once a week, your skin is gonna feel so good. I woke up the next day after the first time using it and I was like, my face feels so soft. So I definitely recommend it. It is a little pricey, you know, it's you know over $30, but 
It's a once a week treatment. It will last you for a long time because you're only supposed to use like a nickel size and exfoliate. But ooh, if you guys have like those things on your nose like I do, where like you have like those white heads like scrub on that area and then the next day it won't look so bad. Oh, I love it so much, you guys. I can go on and on, but you guys get the point, I love it. So this mascara is by Wet n Wild. It's from the Fergie line and it's called Turn Up The Volume. I used it in a tutorial before and I didn't know if I liked it that much, but all of a sudden throughout the month, I've been reaching for it because I really do like it because like it volumizes the lashes and it also lengthens at the same time. It kind of reminds me of my old favorite Buxom mascara and Buxom is like $19. This is drugstore price, it's like under four bucks. So it's a fantastic mascara. I definitely recommend it and it separates the lashes and I really love how it holds my curl and I'm wearing it right now alone, like nothing else, no primer on the lashes or anything. And it even separates the bottom lashes, which is really awesome because usually when I like mascaras, I only like putting it on the top because the bottom lashes look clumpy, but this, is amazing, I definitely recommend it. The only thing is it dries quickly, so I find myself having to buy more often because it dries quickly. Now we're moving on to the random favorites, you guys. I got this from my friend Norma. <laughs> it's called the Of Glove. Oh, thank you Norma so much for this Of Glove because I freaking love it. It is the best little pot holder I've ever owned because it like grips things when I'm baking and I have two of them so like I use both in both hands and it's just amazing how it grips and I just feel so safe using My it. My last favorite would be these shoes. They're by Skechers and they're memory foam um, and I think they're pretty cute as well. I haven't bought like new sneakers for myself in like years because I was so addicted to these like um, LA gear shoes that I had and I wouldn't let go of them, but I really needed a new pair and oh When you walk into this you're walking into a memory foam heaven cloud. They are so incredibly comfortable They have them in different colors, but I went to DSW and I bought these and I I didn't see like a plain white and pink color So I bought mint and I freaking love this color it it goes with everything because you know sneakers don't have to match with everything You know what I mean? And oh my goodness, you guys, I feel so ripped off because I thought that going to DSW, I was gonna save money because you know it's a shoe warehouse. Tell me why on Amazon is $10 less. So if you guys are interested, I'll provide the link and it's $10 less on Amazon. So those are my beauty and random favorites and I also wanted to share that I have an online store. It's called SaturdaySunshine.com. I sell a lot of things that I created with my husband and, with, and then we get it manufactured. And this time around, we just launched some awesome stuff. We launched a tumbler infuser so you can put fruit inside this infuser and water and it'll make like flavored fruit water and oh, I freaking love this. It's BPA free plastic and it has my Saturday Sunshine logo. And I love the sun. It's so happy and bright and that's why it is the logo that I chose. And it also comes with a straw. And also I've been obsessed with mason jars or like that whole mason look. So I also manufactured a mason cup or and it's made of BPA free plastic and it also comes with a straw. So if you guys are interested, check out my site SaturdaySunshine.com and you guys can be able to buy it if you guys want to. So those are my favorites and I hope you friends enjoyed. Please give this video a thumbs up and I will see you guys next time. Bye. I'm gonna be a grandma! Oh, oh my, god. my god, I can't oh. believe it! <laughs> I can't oh believe it! Congratulations, sweetheart, I love you so much. Oh, I'm so happy.